Uh, can I reserve all my rights prior to crossing the bench? Say what? I'd like to reserve all my rights prior to crossing the bench. Does anyone have any contestant to that? Okay. Just wanted to make sure I could reserve all my rights prior to that. How are you doing today? Mr. Cooks, I've got two tickets to talk to you about. One of them is registration expired. How do you plead to that? Um, I do not wish to make any pleads, uh, pleas at this time. I'd like to uh, challenge the jurisdiction of the court. Okay. Well, what I'll do, I'll satisfy your curiosity. I'll enter a not guilty and set you for a jury trial. Um, that would be the, your honor practicing law from the bench, which is not authorized. It may not be, but we'll find out. Okay. All right. You take these on over to see the prosecutor and develop your pre-trial material. All right, and I'd just like, to, uh, for the record, right. that I object to the proceedings. Take him over and let him contemplate these. Come matters. this way. All right. Thank you. and insurance. Did you have insurance? Uh, I didn't want to answer any questions. Okay. Um, I just wanted to know if you had uh, your delegation of authority or anything. I want to challenge the jurisdiction of the court. You'll have to file a motion. I'll have to file a motion to challenge the jurisdiction of the court? Yes. Okay. Would I do that here? Turn it into the court. Okay. And is there anything else that you need with me at this time? So, have you pled not guilty to the judge? Um, I assume that he had to uh, put in a plea for you. Um, he actually exercised a uh, practicing law from the bench. making a request for evidence or discovery from the state today? That's correct. What are you requesting? Um, a delegation of authority. That's not available. Um, it's not discovery. Well, it is discovery if I'm present, uh, presumed innocent until proven guilty. One of the elements of the not crime. Discovery. It's not relevant to Well, one of the stuff. elements of the crime is jurisdiction, so I'd have to be right, presumed that's guilty of discovery. jurisdiction also. The only discovery that we provide to you has to do with the elements of the stock, crime, correct. the registration, and the insurance. So is there any evidence that you want to request as far as the registration and the insurance? Um, how about an avertment of authority? Do you have that? A what? Avertment of authority. Um, that's just saying that you received authority from a higher court to prosecute. The authority is written in the public law. Okay. I would need to see that public law. I'm going to put down that you're not requesting discovery because you haven't given me any items that you have requested. Okay. You need to sign a date right there. And what am I signing and dating? Uh, you're signing that you're requesting a trial and that you are not requesting any discovery that we can provide to you. Um, that's not correct. I actually asked for your delegation of authority. That's not discovery. Okay, then I don't really want to sign this. So you're refusing that's correct. to proceed? That's correct. Okay. 
Do you want to send him back in front of the judge? Because we can't proceed without him signing this. Okay. All right, come on back oh, in. Pardon. Might be I'm okay, Stan. Uh, if you don't want to sit down, why don't you help him get out to the recreation area there? I'm in the way of someone. Judges don't allow people standing in the courtroom. Okay. Are we going back outside? that the issue of jurisdiction is a pretrial matter that needs to be decided before trial. Once you go forward with your trial, the issue of jurisdiction is not to be brought up. Um, it is my understanding that the issue of jurisdiction can be brought up at any time during the court proceeding. It needs to be determined prior to going to trial. Yes, ma'am. Take that to the clerk window out there and I'll set your court date. All right. No, they didn't, but oh. I, uh, I've never tried it before. I just wanted to challenge the jurisdiction of the court. And, what? What, um, and people, it's funny because you can see their face turn like they got upset. Yeah. yeah, but I wasn't doing anything wrong. But I just challenged the jurisdiction of the court. Like, yeah. This is a private, uh, this is a private bank, really. The court system, every court. Each one of them are private. Privately owned or whatever. Yeah. So they'll act as if this is law, but they're talking about statutes and codes. 
statutes and codes only apply to their employees, not us. Mm -hmm. yeah. Or I have a friend who, like, he works for the state, and he doesn't have to go to the state, so unless, like, we're not really breaking the law, because you're not doing an act against the law. Yeah, exactly. You have an injured person on property. Right, because of how the yeah. It's the common law. That's what he used to say. Yeah. 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 See how defensive they got that quickly? Mm -hmm. They got real defensive. That lets me know I'm, like, I'm working in the air force. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And then are we supposed to return that to somebody? Okay. That's it? Yeah. Well, I don't know if he actually wants to hand that into his school. Really. <laughs> I'm just thinking twice about it. I may just say that he was uh, sleeping on the way. I was given this by the uh, pro se cuter. Um, I just want the, uh, I don't understand uh, the charges that are being brought against me. Do you have your ID with you? Uh, no, I don't. If I wanted to request a motions hearing, but at this time I do not have my motions, how would I go about that? Any motions have to be in two days prior to your trial. Okay. Will I have 10 days prior to my trial date? to make sure that it's okay with them because they know what I'm going to do. They know that I'm fighting.
Ticket is 150. One ticket is 325. It's $475 they're trying to extort. And as far as me uh, turning in my motions, I'll just bring them here. You can file them with the clerk. Okay. I wasn't submitting them to the proxy Okay. Let me guess, I'm going to have to sign these, correct? Mm -hmm. And if I don't really want to add my uh, name to any adhesion contracts, how would that work? You don't want to write your name? Yeah, I don't want to. I'll just write this to you. But I do understand the, the dates. So you didn't want a sign of plea? Uh, I do not make pleas. Okay. Do you want to fill out a request to record the hearing? Uh, yes, ma'am. Okay. Well, actually, no, I don't. Okay. I don't want to add my name to